In India, I spent many years watching the reactions of Indians walking out of movie theaters after seeing Hollywood production. They, they couldn't figure out why Americans are so wasteful. They smash their cars, their shiny cars every five minutes. How come they shoot each other for half million dollars? Is it true that they are so sex, sex uh, 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 I mean obsessed with sex? Can you imagine showing a movie where each five minutes there is a copulation on the screen to a country like India with long traditions, tradition of, of uh, respect to, to this private matter? Or to Pakistan? And United States expect these people to respect you? No way. Oh yes, they will see the movie, they'll pay five rupees to see that garbage. But they walk out and will tell their kids, don't respect Americans, don't be like Americans. See? So, the process of demoralization could be stopped right here, both as an expert and as an import. And that takes one step, one very important thing to do. You don't have to expel all the KGB agents from Washington, D.C. The most difficult and at the same time the simplest answer to the subversion is to start it here and even before. By bringing back the society to religion. Something that you cannot touch and eat and put on yourself. But something that rules society and makes it move and preserve it. A Soviet scientist, Shafarevich, who has nothing to do with religion, he is a computer scientist, did a very intensive research <coughs> on the history of socialist countries. He calls socialist or communist <coughs> any country with a centralized economy and a pyramidal style of power structure. And he discovered, actually he didn't discover it, he just brought to attention of, of his readers, that civilizations like Mohenjo-Daro, in the river Hindus area, like Egypt, like Maya, Incas, like Babylo ba Babylonian culture, collapsed and disappeared from the surface of Earth. The moment they lost religion, as simple as that, they disintegrated. Nobody remembers about them anymore. Well, distantly. <clears throat> so, the ideas are moving society and keeping mankind as a as, as society of human beings, intelligent, moral agents of God. The facts, the truth, the exact knowledge may not. All the sophisticated technology and computers will not prevent society from disintegrating and eventually dying out.